Romans 1 verse 16 first shall be last gospel. Romans 1 verse 16. For I am not ashamed of the gospel, for it is the power of God for salvation to everyone who believes, to the Jew first and also to the Greek. Paul wrote an epistle to the believers living in Rome, Italy. Rome was the capital of the Roman Empire and some Jews who believed Jesus was the Lord lived there. God's word is complete evidence that Jews dwell in many places other than Israel. Jacob's family traveled to Egypt because of the terrible famine, Genesis chapter 45. In the book of Ruth, an Israelite family moves away from Bethlehem to Moab, which is modern-day Jordan, Ruth 1-1-4. Many Jews had accepted Jesus as the Son of God, Messiah, but a lot more did not. In the first century, after Jesus had resurrected and ascended back into his heavenly kingdom, many Jews and Greeks or Gentiles worship and fellowship to praise and glory the resurrected Savior. This was common and written many times in the Acts of the Apostles. Also, many Jews were living not in Israel, so Paul, Peter, and James wrote epistles to different parts of the world they knew. One primary reason was the Jews who had rejected Jesus as the Messiah were persecuting the Jews who had. Therefore, the epistle of James was written to encourage the Jews who scattered everywhere, enabling them to keep their faith and not be ashamed of the gospel. James 1 verse 1 James, a bondservant of God and of the Lord Jesus Christ, to the twelve tribes who are dispersed abroad, greetings. To consider it all joy, my brothers and sisters, when you encounter various trials, three knowing that the testing of your faith produces endurance. Four, and let endurance have its perfect result, so that you may be perfect and complete, lacking in nothing. Now Jesus is still the King of Kings, Lord of Lords, and King of the Jews, and initially, He created the Greeks and all who live on earth. All humanity has the choice to believe Jesus is the Son of God, and they likewise will not be ashamed of the Gospel. Jesus also will not be ashamed of calling them believers His, but He is ashamed of those who say they are God's chosen people but do not live like it. It makes Him want to vomit them because their testimony is vanity. Jew, Greek, Hebrew, Christian, Gentile, male, female, or just a bondservant. If you and I must accept Jesus as Lord, then He is our King. Do not trust the media, other Christians, or a church. The Word of God is where the actual foundation is. God bless you all. The King of the Jews loves you, and so do I, His humble bondservant, Samuel Jerry Head. Acts 26 verse 20 But continually proclaimed to those in Damascus first, and in Jerusalem, and then all the region of Judea, and even to the Gentiles, that they are to repent and turn to God, performing deeds consistent with repentance. 21 For these reasons, some Jews seized me in the temple and tried to murder me. 22 So, having obtained help from God, I stand to this day testifying both to small and great, stating nothing but what the prophets and Moses said was going to take place, 23 As to whether the Christ was to suffer, and whether, as first from the resurrection of the dead, he would proclaim light both to the Jewish people and to the Gentiles.